Good afternoon and happy Wednesday to all of your sunshiny faces. So guys, I realized that I probably should have made my grocery list today because tomorrow we're actually, I'm not going to cook dinner tomorrow, so I only cook two days this week. I don't know if I'm going to cook on Friday. I might try to. We're going to um, go see Ant Man and Wasp tomorrow and we're going to, I think, just get like more takeout because my dad does have to coach over the high school tomorrow um so we can't go out for like a sit down dinner or anything like that and I don't know if my mom's coming because she's like oh, I don't want to see that and we're like she's like I never saw the first one which I'm pretty sure she actually did because I thought we all watched the first one together um the first time um because I actually was watching it and then like everybody kind of filtered in and started watching it together so um or maybe I like rewound it I think I started watching it and my dad's like oh I want to see it and so like that was before I was like into watching Marvel movies or anything like that um I ended up watching just that one <laughs> and so um I only watched it too because it was on like um I think like Stars or HBO or something like that and so I was like oh I'll watch this and um I just decided to but she's like oh I don't know if I want to go she's like because I've never seen that she's like I don't even really know what it's about and she's like I don't know she's just like picky about like which superhero movie she likes to watch like she went and saw the Infinity Wars with us but she was like I didn't know half those people in the movie <laughs> I was like yeah it's because you didn't watch half of them like with us and stuff like that like obviously like the main group of the Avengers like the core ones that were like in the first Avengers movie and stuff like that like she knows and her like favorite is Captain America but she hasn't watched like any of the really newer ones I don't think like obviously she knows who Spider-Man is but um and I think she saw the Black Panther also with us um but I think I don't even know if there really was any other ones <laughs> but um yeah I think too when we saw uh Civil War because he's in Civil War but he wasn't in the Infinity Wars um but she didn't know who he was and I think even to like Falcon and some of the other characters she was like I don't know who that is I don't know who that is I think she just doesn't pay attention like I think she just like I don't even know she like knows like the main ones but then she doesn't really like I don't think she even pays attention to know who anybody else is like oh that's that guy like we're always trying to put little like hints and things like that together because they always kind of do leave like little easter eggs and stuff like that in the movies and my mom's like wait who's the main guy in this movie like she's just kind of oblivious I think to some of the stuff that goes on so I don't know if she's going to see it she said a couple times now she's like I really don't want to go and see that one so we're like okay so I don't know if she's going to come with but we are going to get dinner tomorrow night um and like I said it's probably just going to be like takeout for maybe Augustino's or something um but then we're going to go see the movie I think is it like 7 25 or something like that tomorrow night so that's what we're going to do and then I think we are all caught up as far as like movies that we've wanted to see because we saw The Incredibles we saw the Jurassic World movie and we saw um or we're going to see Ant-Man and Wasp um and then I think until like any other big ones come out that we really want to see there's really nothing else like there's no movie that I've like either seen commercials for or like you know trailer for or anything like that um, then I'm like, oh, I really want to see that movie. Like, maybe, like, more when Halloween rolls around, there might be a scary movie that I want to go see, but there's nothing that I know of that's coming out that I really want to go and see, like, right now, where I'm like, oh, I want to see that. Like, The Incredibles was one thing that I knew I wanted to go and see. I guess, too, I think I told you guys the new Dumbo movie, um, like, the real life, you know, one, um, whatever it is, that one I really do think I might want to see just because it does look it looks kind of good I think it's going to be like a cool take on the story um and a little bit different so that's why I kind of want to see see what it's all about um so that's one I know but then there's no other ones like I said that's coming out and I don't even think that one's coming out until like 2019 or something like that so that one I don't even think is this year um and that's the same too with I'm not sure when like Captain Marvel's coming out and I thought there was maybe that and then the um what was it called the next infinity war movie um but that one i don't think is to like sometime next spring or summer or something like that that, that comes out and i don't know when the captain marvel one comes out actually i made dinner for tonight and i've been doing really good with my meal prep and stuff like that i've had my breakfast potatoes and i have had my um 
what's it called like my lunch or dinner or whatever um and then in between like if i'm still hungry or something like that i had popcorn for today too because my mom was making something i was like oh that smells really good i want some popcorn but i have been like snacking on like like granola bars and like also to these energy bars from aldi and i told you guys i think um that i think they're supposed to be and i'll show you guys the packaging on these they came with six bars and i think i've had one just about every single day i didn't have one actually today though um but they're like these energy bars and as you guys can kind of see i think they're supposed to be like um cliff bars um this one's the chocolate chip one that i got i think they only have like three varieties or whatever but here's it compared to like a regular cliff bar like you guys can tell it's kind of like the same like square more than like a um like regular granola bar and this one's chocolate brownie but honestly guys i've had so many cliff bars and stuff like that they've never tasted sweet to me and i kind of looked on the ingredients just to see like oh was there something that was like added to these that makes them taste sweeter and i was looking and there wasn't really anything that i could find i don't know if these are full organic or not but i know that these have like there's 70 percent i think organic ingredients and non-gmo which i think these might be too so i was looking on the ingredients for the actual cliff bars and what i noticed is that um i think like these ones to keep them together they use dates um this is in here somewhere <laughs> i don't remember where i saw it right here it says organic date paste and like i said in the cliff bars at least in this particular one this chocolate brownie which yes isn't the same as chocolate chip but i did notice that it doesn't taste exactly like this kind tastes sweeter to me for some reason and i think that's kind of why the other thing that they do add on here and i could taste it but i didn't actually notice that it was an ingredient was the cinnamon it tastes with the dates that kind of taste sweet it doesn't taste like chocolate chip to me or like a chocolate chip cookie or anything like that it tastes like a sweet like apple cinnamon kind of with chocolate chips mixed into it and it tastes like a granola bar because it's got like the you know the rolled oats and like kind of granola and whatnot you know kind of taste to it so these are really confusing to me because if they're trying to go for being cliff bars like these ones no they don't taste the exact same and they taste like like i said i don't know it's really bizarre to me like i feel like if they would have packaged it as being like an apple cinnamon you know chocolate chip or just like apple cinnamon or something like that i could have been like wow these actually taste really good but giving me the illusion that they're chocolate chip with cinnamon mixed in and like the sweetness from the dates, um, which is again, what I really think that I'm tasting in there that's like tastes so sweet. Um, like I said, it kind of tastes like that, like date, like almost like apples kind of sweetness kind of thing. And I just like can't get over it. They're actually really good and I've had two of them now I think and I haven't like you know they've been pretty good but I just I can't get over the fact that I think that they're gonna taste like cliff bars and they taste like something else <laughs> like do you guys have that too where you're like you buy something and maybe it's like not the exact same brand or something like that and you're like oh I expected these to kind of at least taste a little bit more similar then like I don't know why but chocolate chip to me tastes like I'd expect it to taste like a um granola bar with chocolate chips in it almost like a oatmeal cookie with chocolate chips or something like that like that was what i had in my mind when i bought it and they don't taste like that to me like i said they taste it tastes really weird that there's cinnamon in it too like i don't really know why they had to add the cinnamon to it if it just was the dates and the date parts taste sweet and it has the you know the chocolate chips in there which again you can kind of taste but it doesn't taste chocolatey either like chocolate chips chocolate it's supposed to taste more like chocolate but every once in a while you get a random chocolate chip it's like okay like i don't really understand guys <laughs> and i'm so confused like i said they're really good i actually really like them but I can't understand why they're packaged as chocolate chips and they don't really taste like chocolate chip to me. Like, if it was like, and if they don't even say anywhere else on there like chocolate chip, you know, or like sweet chocolate chip or like cinnamon chocolate chip, like nothing else. Like, I just, I can't really understand it, guys. Um, and they do have, like I said, a couple other flavors, but I went in there thinking it was going to taste like a Cliff Bar, which to me, a Cliff Bar tastes like a granola bar flavored with whatever they are saying it's going to be flavored with. This doesn't necessarily say it's going to be flavored with anything. It just says chocolate chip. But I've tried a couple of their protein bars. My dad actually really likes them. And he buys like the more expensive, like the Quest bars from GNC and stuff like that. And he really liked them. I just hate, hate protein bars 
in general. They have to be something like an energy bar or like something that doesn't have that processed like protein bar taste to them. I can't stand them. I've made my own protein bars and they taste amazing. I love them. But I can't buy for some reason like the Quest bars or like really any other, I don't even know, like pure protein, like those type of protein bars. I cannot get over the taste of the like interior part of the protein bars so i have tried this elevation brand um like quest, like quest bars i guess or like protein bars whatever they are um and like i said i just can't stand them i can't stand any protein bar stuff so it doesn't matter what brand it's from but um my mom too she actually really really loves it's like their low carb chocolate coconut bars or something like that and they're like low carb high protein um, and she really likes those. She says they taste like Almond Joy bars. Um, with obviously, you know, the protein and stuff like that without it actually being an Almond Joy bar. But, um, yeah, I've been really trying to find something that's like a good protein bar. Something that's like a good, like, you know, it doesn't necessarily have to be a protein bar. But like some type of energy bar or some type of like bar that I can kind of just grab and go. And I... I don't know like I said I like these ones and obviously getting them at Aldi is like way cheaper than getting them at you know Walmart or something like that where I have to buy like actual brand ones and stuff like that um but I don't know guys I haven't yet found something that I am like perfectly in love with I've had like the special K meal bars I like those um and there was another type of protein bar that I actually didn't mind too much but I don't remember what it was um that I was eating oh I really like Lara bars those are really good Good. um but again because they're like more like like a low ingredients I think like they're not like protein powder you know protein bars or whatever like the Lara bars are again my favorite and I don't know if those are classified as energy bars or protein bars or what they are but like you know like some type of snack bar that's kind of filling um other than just like a cheapy granola bar or something like that um, so I've been trying to find something and like I said I want to try like almost all the Aldi brand stuff and figure out which one I like the most. They also have, I think, like, lemon bar, which I think I might like a lot more. But if it tastes like cinnamon and dates, <laughs> I don't know if I'm going to like it. Um, so, yeah, I think I'm going to, after this week, if I finish these ones, um, get another package and try them. Because they're not super expensive. I think they're, like, $5.99 or something like that for six bars, which is only a dollar a bar, which, again, isn't too bad of a price. Um, and I know that, like, Cliff Bars sometimes go on sale for that, but I think sometimes they're more money. They're, like, $1.50 or whatever. So, again, Again, if it's going for trying to be like a cliff bar I think it's a reasonable price but I just couldn't get over the fact that you know, I was expecting to eat the chocolate chip and I like have eaten them like I said I've had them twice now and every single time I'm like I can't figure out if I actually like this like I feel like maybe if it tasted like cinnamon and dates without the chocolate chips I'd like it more and or if it tasted like chocolate chips without the cinnamon in there then maybe I could get over the date taste but I, it's like a really weird combination and I like it but I can't figure out if I'm, it's not one of those like where I'm like, oh my gosh, this is so good. It's like, it's a pretty good bar. Like, I don't know, guys. Um, that's just my randomness for today about my little um, energy bar dilemma I think that I'm having is that I like to have something that I can kind of fill in too, like in between like a lunch or breakfast or something like that. Um, or like dinner whatever kind of fill in between like meals and stuff like that because I think I've told you guys too for me I don't like to just eat like one big meal I like to snack throughout the day like after dinner normally is when I wind up eating like all of the vegetables and stuff like that that we've had from dinner um, I don't like to eat it with my dinner I just like to like you know maybe about a half hour later or something like that that's when I actually eat the vegetables <laughs> so um, I don't like to have it with my actual like meal um, or I might like reheat something or something something like that if it was like a side dish or whatever from dinner but I don't like to actually eat it with dinner so I'm a snacker throughout the day kind of um which like I said though I like to snack on healthier things which is really good but it's just you know I'll have my pea crisps and um like freeze-dried strawberries and stuff like that and I like to have some type of granola bar or meal bar energy bar or if it's a good protein bar um 
but I just, I can't really, like, I haven't been able to pin anything down that I know I can get every week, because I don't go to Walmart every single week, so I might not be able to get, like, you know, if there's, and the Laura bars, too, are pretty expensive. I think they're only a five pack, but they're, like, seven or eight dollars. Like, they're not really that cheap, um, and these, I thought, were pretty competitively priced and a lot cheaper, um, so that's why I feel like I like these ones more, because I feel like they're better price range-wise, but I haven't been able to figure out one now that I absolutely love and there was something though at Aldi I remember having I think it was maybe a meal bar that I really liked it was like a pretzel like caramel pretzel or something like that it kind of reminded me of the special K like meal bars but I haven't seen it like at least since I've been shopping at the other Aldi's and since our Aldi's remodeled I don't know that I've seen it and that's what I think I was looking for this last weekend I couldn't find it and so that's why I picked these up to try them out like I said I like them they are pretty good they're tasty you know I didn't spit it out like I did with the, with the protein bar but I haven't been able to figure out to like a perfect like I really really like you know that one you know bar or whatever i have those and then i also too got this week like the nature valley peanut butter bars and so i like to snack on those too so i might have that like maybe one of them after breakfast you know a little while but before lunch and then maybe another one after lunch but before dinner or something like that and then normally that's when i throw my freeze-dried strawberries in like after dinner or i might have a smoothie or i might have some berries some fresh berries or whatever um or i might have like the leftover vegetables and stuff like that um, and so, you know, like today too, I had hummus and pretzels. So I snacked throughout the day, like I said, but I like to have, um, granola bars too, especially if I know I'm going to be leaving somewhere and I'm going to go and I can be like, oh, I'll just grab this and eat it in the car or whatever. But I haven't been able to find anything that I am perfectly in love with, in love with yet, um, that probably I'd find at Aldi. And like I said, I found those ones and now I haven't seen them anymore. And now I'm really scared that I'm not going to be able to find them because I did really like them. Those. but um these are like i said i think they're more filling though than those meal bars that i've had before like these actually fill me up a lot more um but and like i said they're tasty it's just i don't understand why they're cinnamon in <laughs> but anyways though guys i'll see you all in tomorrow's vlog if you guys did enjoy today's make sure you guys give a big old thumbs up if you guys are new we'd love if you'd subscribe and i'll see all your some shiny faces tomorrow so bye guys